Hello everyone, this is your friend Amali. Today we are going to talk about why everyone should not practice every yoga pose. There are some reasons behind it. First thing, let us take some example. Let us take example of half shoulder stand. Half shoulder stand is very good for high back patient. But at the same time, full shoulder stand is not good for high back patient people who has high blood pressure that is irregulated they should not practice full shoulder stand if someone has heart problem they should not practice full shoulder stand okay. in fact if someone has heart problem they should not practice plow pose they should not practice any yoga or any exercise that take your lower portion of your body above the upper portion of your body right so we must know the yoga pose we are practicing is that is apt for our particular health condition if we have something so it's better it's always better to talk to a yoga guru to know that if that particular pose is good or healthy for your particular health condition for example if someone has hernia and that person is practicing triangle pose that person is practicing bow pose that person is practicing downward facing dog that practicing that person is practicing uttanasana that person is harming himself or himself herself right because that actually exert pressure on your stomach and that increase the hernia problem so you must know before practicing a particular yoga pose if you are particularly healthy 100% perfect then it's fine you can practice anything but if if you have something that concerns you please talk to your as as if you talk to your doctor the same way you should practice talk to your yoga guru because the same way your yoga guru is also trying to help you with your health condition right and if someone has gone through surgery they should not practice any yoga pose in six months and when they start also they should start very slowly in consultation of some yoga guru not alone and again some if someone is starting yoga for first time in their life they should go very slow they should start with micro yoga that too with help of your guru because they should know how much your muscle is ready for it so slowly you should take it slowly you should make your muscle ready for it and then you go to intense yoga practice all right thank you everyone thank you for your time you have a blessed day